the two actually connect is the flagpole and the mast. That's and symbolic. Because in 1950, they actually started oh raising the flag over the ship again. So even though it was stricken from the record in 1950 to begin with, they raised the flag. So here, is what Admiral Radford said, and they began doing it again. Um, so from 1950 until 1962, the Navy would have ceremonial flag raisings every morning and every afternoon at the close of day. Um, so symbolically, these two points connect because the flag still flies over the Arizona every day as if it did on the morning. Wow. And so Lou Conter, who you met today, mm -hmm. he was located right over here just before the quarter deck. So this was his part of the ship. He's right below us, right over on this side. So wait, what are, what's all that? Uh, different parts of it. Uh, and so in the interments, the ship was returned to the ship. The Navy diaper, the Navy National Treasure flag was still on the ship. So ladder right over here. Mm -hmm. We actually go back and get out of the island to gun chart number four. Excuse us for just a couple of seconds. We're going to do a flag raising. Absolutely. Uh, if you want to watch that, uh, yeah. from the USS Tennessee, which was two over. And so it was the West Virginia and the Tennessee. And the Tennessee was actually protested, protected by the West Virginia. So the Tennessee is actually marked right over there. Oh, wow. On two over. And so he's actually from the Tennessee oh. right here. So you can watch that. Thanks for that. They don't. 
Thank you. 